Oh man, so what are we doing today? Um, we're turning the Traxxas Slash into a brushless slash. And what do we have? Um, the, how do you say this? I would say Connexus is what it looks like to me. It's for one tenth scale. It's a four pole, 4,000 kV motor. Yep. With the Open ES that thing up. ESC combo. So that's what it looks like in the box. And <clears throat> are you just going to take the connector off the original motor for it to fit? The spur gear? Yeah, the spur gear. gear. Yeah, the pinion gear. Yes. That's <clears throat> what we're going to do. So essentially, and this was made by who? Horizon Hobby? Horizon Hobby. And you bought it for how much? Um, I bought it for $80, but if you go to Horizon Hobby and buy it, it's 75 Okay. So you get a better deal off of Horizon Hobby? Yes. Way better. All right. So... I guess we're going to slap this on whatever Cameron has going on right here with the modified slash and uh, we'll show you how it goes. Alright Cameron, so what you working on bro? Still working on this. Still working on it? So the progress is coming along how good? Um, good enough. Bro, I love your wiring job. You know once you start wrapping wires around the frame, it's professional, dude. Yes, bro. You know. I'm telling you. I'm ready to see this thing run. I want to see it keep up with the old desert racer over here. All right, so final product. Yeah. Got the motor installed. It looks like it fit in pretty good. Got the battery mounted, the ESCs in and wired up. Doing the final touches, and then we're going to run it and see how it goes. All right, so the first test. Holy crap. Put that thing on the ground. I want to, I want to see how it goes. Woo! Wait, bro, I might have to put my other tires back on. Alright, so we came out here to our running spot where we got a nice wide open dirt road out of the way. Not a lot of vehicles come down it. Bought the Ultimate Desert Racer to compare with the Slash with the modification on it. It's pretty quick. We have a Summit. That's a Summit body, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah Summit body on it. To protect it for now. Just to protect it, because we don't have the body with us right now. But anyways, this is going to be a comparison between the two. So we're going to get these things started and get some video.
So the speed comparison is pretty close because he was keeping up with me on the straightaway. Dude, that was close as hell. Yep. <laughs> Alright guys, so after seeing it run and everything, final opinions on it man, is it worth the money? Oh yeah. It's definitely worth, worth definitely worth the money I think. We haven't had no problems with it yet and it's running good. Everything mounted up, the little fan's working good. Motor does get warm, but we didn't have no problems with it. Of course, it's going really fast, so it's going to get warm anyways. But And it has a temperature cut off. So. Yeah, it does have a safety temperature cut off, that's one good thing about it. But other than that, yeah guys, it works, if you're looking for an upgrade. Go ahead and pick up one. It's the Conexus 110 4 pole 4000 kV motor and ESC combo. And it works great. So please remember to like and subscribe and see you on the next video.